One of the eminent physicians with whom Owen Murphy became acquainted was pediatrician Dr. Edward Connor of Meadville, Pennsylvania. Dr. Connor talked with Murphy about his ambition to develop a new kind of children's rehabilitation clinic. Murphy's generosity and Dr. Connor's skill resulted in the establishment in Meadville of the Fairyland Clinic for Handicapped Children. From the unique nameplate showing St. George the Defender slaying the dragon of disease and the colorful wheelchair ramp leading to the main entrance, children get a promise of the make-believe atmosphere which pervades the whole clinic. There are no sterile whites in this clinic, no frightening clinical-looking equipment. Instead, we see an array of workable mechanical toys, each equipped with relaxing Niagara motors, and each designed to stimulate the child to perform some sort of play activity which will exercise a specific group of muscles. Treatment becomes play, and happiness and fun is the order of the day. Even the less pleasant treatment procedures are given on Niagara-equipped treatment tables, which take the child's attention away from the treatment itself. The heartwarming results obtained here at Fairland Clinic have been the subject of articles in such magazines as Look, Coronet, Woman's Home Companion, This Week, Popular Mechanics, MD, and Modern Medicine. Arlene Francis devoted an entire half-hour television program to it, and the entire story of the clinic was told on the Robert Montgomery Theater under the title of The Dr. Ed Story. Fairyland Clinic is the brainchild of Dr. Ed, but it is the gift of Owen Murphy to the world. Like Dr. Ed, Peter and Sue Creeley are dedicated to changing the lives of sick kids just like little Jimmy. With the support of Niagara staff, Peter and Sue are bringing the magic of Fairyland centres to sick kids in Australia. The amazing centres really are life-changing for the kids and their families.